EA Sports. It's in the game. The air raid offense is, is really good because it, it allows a guy who loves to kind of live out that dream of being a quarterback that's running an offense where you're throwing it 50 or 60 times in a game. The spread offense is kind of become the, the offense that is very trendy in college football in the last three years. I think with, with NCAA football 2011, I think the thing that you're going to see with the spread is you can be pretty much any of the versions that you're going to watch on a given Saturday. Multiple offense obviously uh, gives you an opportunity to, to run a bunch of different formations. And I think it's probably one of the most difficult to defend because when you have a multiple offense, you can attack a defense by lining up under center and running the football and being physical. I think most people think of a one-back offense, you're obviously going to have three or four wide receivers. Um, but you still, to make the one-back offense really be effective, you have to have a tailback that gives the defense enough of a threat to think that once in a while they're going to be running the football. I love the option because I think it, it really puts a lot on the quarterback. You know, as a quarterback, you have to be able to do so many different things when you're running an option attack. And how cool is it for the gamers to actually get an opportunity to get the snap, not have any idea what you're going to do with the ball, and, and you have to make your decision based on what the defense does. Run and shoot is old school offense. You know, that, that's going back, uh, really all the way back to, to the mid 80s. And what it is, is a quarterback that literally is going to throw the ball 60 times in a football game. He's going to take a snap, and as soon as he gets the snap, he's looking to get the ball out of his hands as quickly as possible. When you think of a West Coast offense, it's more of a rhythmic offense. He's going to rely on a heavy dose of the running game, but he also, when he gets back, He's going to drop back from the center, and by the time he hits his fifth step or his seventh step in his drop, he's made his, his decision based on what he's reading, and the ball is out of his hand. The pistol offense is it still keeps the quarterback back in the shotgun, but you have a tailback now instead of being next to you in the shotgun, he's directly behind you. But again, it's one of these offenses that it's all predicated upon a quarterback who can run and who can throw, and if you have that, uh, you can really make that offense work. Only NCAA Football 11 gives you 120 ways to win.